FFA students are being recognized for their work with puppies. That's right. Sounds like fun. Our Christina Tetro joins us live from Lemoore High School with oh. some of the students Wait. there. All right. That's not Christina. Uh. <laughs> Couldn't tell. Or is it? I figured that you guys would want to see this face much more than mine. Look at that. So we are here at Lemoore High School with quite an adorable group of pups here. The students, you guys are all adorable as well, but I mean a little bit overshadowed by how beautiful these pups are. Now they're here for a very important reason. They're actually being raised for Guide Dogs for the Blind, an incredible organization that provides free of charge, I believe, um, guide dogs for those who are seeing impaired. And actually it's a project for the Future Farmers of America here at Lemoore High School. I'm joined here live with Mary Beth. Beth Hearn, Hearn. Thank you. Yes, Hearn. Good morning. Go, good morning. And go ahead and tell us, what do you guys do here? Because this program is pretty remarkable. Thank you. Well, welcome to Lamore High School. Thank you. Um, these are my FFA Guide Dogs for the Blind puppy raisers. And the uh, process for these students is they get these beautiful puppies at about eight to 10 weeks of age and they raise them, they keep them till they're about 14 to 17 months, socializing them, teaching them good house skills, um, oh, simple obedience skills, and then at the end of that process, the puppies are returned to one of the two guide dogs for the blind campuses, the headquarters, which is in San Rafael, California, or to the school in Boring, Oregon, <laughs> just outside of Portland, where, th where they begin, I'm sorry, their formal guide dog training. And you said this was the first program, I believe, here in the state. It right? is. It is. In fact, um, Lemoore FFA is the pioneer school for starting the Guide Dog for the Blind Raising uh, Project for the National FFA. It was recognized as a national SAE project um, back in 2014. So we're very excited about that. Now, very proud. Before I introduce everyone, I do want to know, what was the award that you guys just won? We were just selected uh, by the Lemoore Chamber of Commerce as the Organization of the Year. And we and are so time, right? first time ever, and we're just really, really proud of that. Absolutely. Fantastic. Now we're going to show off these students as well as their guide dogs. We're going to start right here. Can you guys each tell me your name and introduce your pup? Um, my name is Emily Rodriguez, and this is my dog mentor, and he is 16 months. Great, thank you. My name is Hunter Cole. This is my dog Hildy, and she is nine months. Hi, my name is Sierra Phelps, and this is my dog Sachi, and she has just turned a year old. And you've had how many dogs? Four. She's my fourth. Awesome. My name is Samantha Costin, and this is Daisy. She's six months old. Hi, my name is Haley Korn, and this is my dog Camille, and she is six months old. Hi, my name is Alyssa Cuthbertson, and this is my dog Alora, and she is 15 weeks old. Weeks, you guys, 15 weeks. Hi, my name is Victoria Sheldon. This is my dog Aloha, and she is 15 weeks old also. Well, Aloha, Aloha. <laughs> Hi, my name is Jansen Cunningham. This is LaForge, and he's 12 weeks old. Now, Jansen and LaForge are the newest members of not only this FFA project, but also the newest member of the little clan here. So continue to stay with us because we're going to not only introduce you continuously to these puppies, but they're going to be doing some tricks for us. All right, look at that little guy. Look at that. They look awake and ready to do tricks, don't you think? Uh, some of them look kind of tired. Okay. They're much more awake <laughs> than I, let me tell you. <laughs> yeah, I bet. <laughs> well, that's because they're eating. Oh, I can't uh, stand how they're All right, Christina, thank you. We appreciate that.